Okay, so you can choose which side to queue up as, or you can just do either. I guess we could just say either, because I don't know how fast the queues are yet. I'd actually like to keep doing quick play and see which one I get put on, and see if there's a trend of which one I get put on more often, so then I can see which side has a higher demand. Because I, hon I honestly don't know which side would be more sought after. You know, on one hand, the Doomslayer side might be more sought after just because people playing multiplayer might already be, you know, since they're already familiar with playing him from the campaign, they might want to do that. But on the other hand, playing on the enemy side is a bit more novel. Okay, first match. Here we go. Oh wow, that was fast. Since it didn't find anyone yet, I thought nothing was going to happen. Uh, am I the Slayer? Yeah, I am. Okay. Looks okay. So I'm glad that the opponent's a Marauder, so I can see how it works. <laughs> these guys have some pretty fancy borders. Maybe they are. Maybe maybe these guys are really good. <laughs> How do you ready up? Oh, hit X. Okay, I guess I can just play it like it's a... As long as you just don't get hit forehead, I guess it's a viable strat. Like they said, Doom Slayers skip more skill-based than strategy-based. <laughs> I have to get both of them in the same 20-second window, though. Oh dang, they're playing the Doom Hunter music. It's the best track in the game. This is so stupid, the way they introduce this. It's like some sort of, like, reality show. Round one. Haha. <laughs> He has a shield on. Oh, maker drones. I hate those. Is it the Marauder somewhere nearby? I don't know if I want to get close to him. Crap, I need more ammo. Oh yeah, I still have fire. Where'd they go? I should probably focus on the on the pain elemental. He's easier to hit. Is that a wall? Oh yeah, he does not have much HP at all. The Marauder has very little. Okay. Need to focus on getting, uh... On getting, uh, loot drops more. The Marauder has way less HP than I was expecting. Oh, we still get one of these? Uh... Let's get the dash. Um... I forgot we couldn't attack yet. Also, I forgot I have no micro-missiles. Need to learn this arena. Thought there was a boost pad over there. Uh. I 
I wonder how many arenas there are in multiplayer. Holy. Oh, so much HP from that. I wanted to get I wanted to get to the uh the Arbalest and the shotgun, but I kept switching to the rocket launcher, which made me take self damage. I don't think the Marauder is invincible though, like the uh like in the campaign. I think you can hit them whenever you want. Does it have to do more matchmaking, or can you just keep rematching? It feels much different. I'm trying to figure out if you can just use the same sort of strat as any sort of arena in the game. Like, if you just run around and try to deal with the, uh... Because I was pretty much exclusively focusing the player demons there, and not the AI. I'm wondering if you should just fight anything. What? I guess one of them left. I'm going to, this time I'm going to try playing it like a campaign level where I just run around and just, I, I won't discriminate between the players and the AI this time to see if that sort of works better. Like maybe just hurt them every now and then. Yeah, I guess less people want to be the Slayer, at least based off of what's happening so far. Is that the same Marauder? No, it's not. I guess people just like playing the Marauder. These are both slow moving ones. <laughs> We're all readied up. I wonder, I still don't know what the Arch Vial would do, since maybe they can just summon way more. Because if everyone can summon enemies, what's the Arch Vial's... What makes the Arch Vial unique? Ratnatron. I need to probably use the rocket launcher there instead. Don't have the grenade ready yet. Oh, he does. He, I, I forgot he has chainsaw here. For some reason, I was just assuming he didn't get the chainsaw here. This cat, this uh, pain elemental isn't as good as the last one.
Okay, got one. Where's the other guy? He plays the demons? Yeah, so one side is the demons, and they're basically playing a real-time strategy game where they can place uh, fodder demons. Hey, I won. Yeah, so one side's the Demon Slayer, which is what they say skill-based, and the Demon side is strategy and teamwork-based. So it's one Slayer versus two main demons that can spawn AI demons, and they can like block. They can they can stop you from uh they can stop you from getting drops, and they can put down debuff zones and stuff. <laughs> so it's like they're playing an RTS game, and I'm just playing Doom. Close enough to hook on. So the uh the, the pain elemental is their weak link here, so I should be focusing him. Can't get armor that way? I think they're hiding better this time. Uh, we we lagged. <laughs> Round lost. Yeah, that was some major rubber banding there. I got dashing already, right? Round three. Let me through! I tried to shoot a grenade into the Cacodeme in there, but I think it was already used. This is a lot faster paced than I thought it was going to be. Hmm. Round four. They just immediately put down the, uh... They rubber banning again. Is it a Baron? Right. The Mancubus is doing a good job positioning himself. I got one of them. Defeat. How many rounds is they win, right? Yeah, okay, so it's it's best of five. Thought that was going to be easy after the first round. <laughs> they started positioning way better after that. I still think I'm obsessing too much with going after the player demons. I think I just need to. Pl I think you're supposed to play it more just like a regular arena and just take out whatever's the biggest threat to you, whatever's near. Oh. If you do a rematch, it forces you to change positions, it cycles out who's the slayer.
Well, that's a cool gate. Do you see that guy's uh, podium? Oh. I, th I think what's happening is it forces people to swap roles if it's a rematch, and people don't want to play that role, so they leave. Let's see if I get Slayer again. How did they get that podium? Yep, yeah, it looks like most people are wanting to be the demon side. So here we can. A lot of people like the Marauder, it looks like. So far, everyone we fought has been a Marauder, a Pain Elemental, or a Mancubus. I wonder how the others are then. So I'm going to probably focus that Pain Elemental with the Rocket Launcher first. <laughs> it's, so fa it's so much faster paced than I was expecting. Another new arena. Wait, this is on Mars. This looks like this looks like an asset taken from Doom 2016. It literally might be. Not that I'm complaining. This probably uses some assets from Doom 2016, I bet. The ground looks just like it. It's like a reality show when they do the intros like this. Round one. I don't know if the, I'll get a clean shot on the pain elemental at all here. Is that a debuff zone? Oh crud, that's quite the uh, hazard. I'm not familiar with these arenas at all. A good hazard. Got that cost three. Dang it, almost got him. Where'd he go? Where is he? He's hiding until the other guy resurrects. There he is. <laughs> he's, he's so fast. He use, I, did he use his haste to get away from me? I need to find the other guy real fast. Got it. Yeah, so you can nuke a Mancubus. I'm pretty sure you can out damage a Mancubus if you just go point blank and do the weapon swap exploit. Okay. Mm. 
I haven't even read what all the upgrades do yet. I should read Master Carver next. Oh, crud. Oh, it's stopping my, uh, glory kill. Where are they? Ran out of dashes? Are you serious? Drop down here, right? Okay, got one. It's the Mancubus. Where is he? There he is. Got it. Oh yeah, you can totally out damage them. If if it's just one v one like that. So it's a good idea for me to focus the Marauder first. Let's do that. Actually, I might want to do Master Carver first. <clears throat> because it's like having to go back and get more resources is kind of what lets them run away. It's kind of what gives up your turn, so to speak. Now yeah, my flamethrower. Did I use it already? Probably not that. I thought the I thought the glory kill was ready, so I tried to go back in. What happened to that? I I saw the glory kill ready, so I tried to go back in, but then the screen was covered by fire. Hmm. <laughs> that was good. Whoa, lagging. Well, I can't- I can't change all the Prowler. There's the one guy left. Where is he? There he is. Got it! Oh. Got both. I thought I got the first guy already for some reason. Okay, I had them both very well, which was ideal. Is that our first win?
And you, once you start getting familiar with these arenas, it'll probably go a lot smoother. <laughs> There's another new one. It looks like the team didn't get shuffled this time, though. This super gore nest, yeah, it looks sort of like the that mid that big middle area in super gore nest. I can't help but just think of like a box cutter attached to Doom Guy's arm when he's in that skin. That costume, his arm blade just looks like a big box cutter. Didn't get any armor from that. Get the chainsaw. I'm so used to being able to do the glory kills from really far away in the campaign from that one perk. Oh, I must. How did I get one? I didn't get any armor from that. What the heck? Nice. He was hiding in that health zone that he made, but it was pretty out in the open still. Can't grab on. Burning hate. Oh, these all seem pretty good. <laughs> you can't escape me. Can't see anything. Dude, that smoke really messed me up. Okay, I'm managing this. What's weird about this is changing your weapons doesn't slow down time because it can't. Okay, Pain Elemental can't be hiding very well. Yeah, he's not.
back here. Dang it! His shield lasted just barely long enough. Did you see how close that was? That was just barely long enough. I don't know if he intentionally did that, but that was good. Where is he? Just staggering them. But uh, this will be a lot easier to finish off. Dang it. I'm not getting both of them at the same time. This is going on a while. Need to get a bunch of resources so I can get them both at the same time. Much lava. I'm not seeing any low tier fodder enemies for me to chainsaw easily. Oh, that was good. Good of them. That was a good time. Try to chainsaw him. Was I too far away? Lost. That went on so long. <laughs> Mr. Carver. I think Master Carver actually might be the best. Because it pretty much it, it sort of weakens their loot block ability. By proxy. Thought there was a way to get in from here. What was pushing me? They're spawning it like in front of me and then I can't move. Okay, where's the uh, elemental? There he is. It's harder for them to hide. Oh, so close. So now I just need to... Find him. There he is. Got him. <laughs> I threw the grenade out, too. The fact that the Mankubai... Like, the fact that everyone respawns with half health, it makes it real easy to nuke the Mankubai real fast if you just rush them down. You can get a BFG. I'm trying the BFG after this one, though. I said that the player demons don't take as much damage from it, but it still seems good, like, if they're both low, if you want to get them both at the same time.
I'm not going to get him in time. That shield lasts too long. <laughs> I just imagine what they're seeing. How come the Mankey Bike gets stuck in the air so much? Oh, you can't go through that? Dang. I haven't killed him yet. I should do that first. That way they'll both respawn with half. What? Smoke bomb like actually moved me. I got him. Got him. Yeah. He, he can't really do anything against me when I'm just running around him. Weapon swapping. <laughs> Dude, I can just imagine what they were seeing. Are they done? No, they're still here. Do I get off of this screen? Oh, back. Ready up. So there's, you can text, chat. I don't know if there's built-in voice chat like in... Actually, I don't remember if I was using a built-in chat for Doom 2016 or if I just got... Or if I just entered people's... Uh, parties, but I used to do voice chat on Doom 2016. Okay, we haven't fought a Revenant yet. They might be hard to catch. I don't think they have much HP, though. So the rocket launcher would be really good against them if they don't hide quickly. There's like a big delay going on. There's a, there's a lot of lag going on there. 
But uh, they, they all went into that tunnel. I was just able to shoot into the tunnel and hit all of them really easily. They made that easy for me. Okay, so where's the Marauder? He's going to be respawning with... Half health? Got him. I threw out the grenade, too. Marauders respawning at half health barely have any HP. There aren't many, like, good starting positions for me. Punched him. Punched the player. <laughs> Just run up and punch him. Dang. Back here. He's just running. <laughs> Get back here. Oh, I got him right after the other one rezzed. Oh, no, okay. I guess they were about to say resurrecting soon. <laughs> he was running the whole time. I had to snipe him with the Arbalest. I like double down. It's, the grenade is really good for boxing them in. Round three. I didn't have my other double jump. I, I hit from the self damage by doing the glory kill. Okay, where's the where's the revenant? There he is. Microwave Veen is pretty good. Wow, that was hairy. Where was he even running? Why was he so hard to catch there? Hello there, Hyde. How are you doing? <laughs> that Marauder was so slippery at the end. Uh, just don't want to be used. Yeah, so you get different upgrades if you lose the round. <laughs> The heck? They're, they give me like no starting positions on this map. What mode is this? Hello there T, this is the multiplayer mode. 
It's a debuff zone. There's a teleporter there. And they can't use it. Okay, get the get the other guy. Where'd he go? Ha, oh, I got him. <laughs> the Revenants are really susceptible to the super shotgun chain like that. Yeah, it's asymmetrical multiplayer. Yeah, so one side plays the Doom Slayer, which is pretty much skill based, and the other side consists of two player demons, and they're basically playing a real time strategy game. Because on their end, it's more about strategy and teamwork. <laughs> and they can place AI controlled demons around the map so it's literally like an rts game on their end and they can put debuff zones like they can put down debuff zones in my way and hazards in my way and they can put like healing zones for them cool i know i've only played as the slayer so far because i'm just queuing up as either and it looks like the slayer is the least popular side to play as but it's working out for me so i'm going to just keep playing whatever if it takes forever for me to actually get a match as the demons, then I'm just going to uh, back out and specifically queue up as that so I can get at least a few in as them. But I don't really care what side I'm on for now since I'm still just learning the arenas. The thing is, though, how I have to win is I have to kill both of the enemies within a 20 second window. So like, if I kill one and I don't kill the other one, after 20 seconds, the other one will respawn with half health. So if I kill one, the other one's likely to just run off and hide until the other one respawns. Which is why I have to run them down. Look at the intros here. It makes me think of like a reality show or something. <laughs> I can't I can't take that seriously. Oh double marauders. I didn't know you could have doubles. Round one. Is are, are both yeah, both of them have been switching up. This is the first map I did. This is kind of a tough comp, actually. back here. I don't know if I can catch him. Dang it. <laughs> if I can hook onto them, there's no escape. Dang it. Oh, look how low he was. This is actually a tough comp. Mm. They both have access to loot block whenever they want. It just has a cooldown. 
two. Oh, crud. It's pushing that a little too close. Crud. Got stuck there. <sighs> that one gets so slippery. <laughs> he just runs for his life the entire time when the other one's he's having to wait on the other one to respawn. Okay, where's the other one? Okay, got them. Wow, that one took a long time. That was a long round. Uh... Yeah. You don't get ice grenade in this. <laughs> it would be... I guess they didn't want you to freeze the opponent and just have them stuck for like three seconds. identify their projectiles very easily like when I'm when I'm doing them it just feels like they're just going so spastic I don't think they expect the second frag grenade because they don't know what upgrade I pick. Where'd he go? They are so hard to catch, especially when they're rubber banding. Are they rubber banding or are they just getting stuck on geometry when they're jumping? <laughs> I 
<laughs> the rockets chased him down. Did you see that? <laughs> Well, they didn't let me pick anything. What the heck? Just spawned right in front of me. Did they place that there? They are so hard to catch. There's so much stuff around me. I feel like I can't even move. Oh man, they won the match. It's a hard comp to deal with. I think my connection with them isn't good, so I'm going to back out and see if I can get uh, match made with another party. Because, like, I couldn't tell. A lot of times it felt like they were rubber banding around. We get stuff. Want to become famous by followers, primes, and viewers on followingbot.com. Wow. Wow, what a, what a steal. <laughs> Why is it still on screen if I... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> What a steal. Wow, isn't doesn't that sound great, guys? What a nice person. A lot of bots are on Twitch recently. You should see YouTube. There's this one bot, Tim, sometimes Tom. I see this bot everywhere. I've been seeing, like, I keep getting this bot on not only my own videos, but I keep seeing this bot everywhere, Tim. It's like, great channel. Keep up the great content. But sometimes his name is Tom. Sometimes I go on a video and I see the same bot, but it's Tom instead of Tim. So changing it up a little. I see. Changing up your strat. So it's not so obvious. Very cool. It's sort of an ebb and flow, though, because, you know, people that make bots, they get a bit more inventive, and then they bypass Twitch and YouTube's, you know, anti-bot features. And then, you know, Twitch and YouTube then respond by innovating their anti-bot features, and then the people that make bots innovate again. It's an ebb and flow back and forth. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm doing quick play. Let's see if I get Slayer again. <laughs> I think people are under the impression that it's easier as the demons, which might be the case. the slayer again <gasps> i'm not the slayer this time See, but happened <laughs> the one time i'm not the slayer you get kicked out i don't know how good the revenant would be though because the revenant seems really susceptible to the rocket launcher and the uh, Super shotgun. You just have to stay really far away from them. Might want to do Pain Elemental instead. But the thing is, I, I selected Revenant since I already played him in the campaign. 
And I'm the Slayer again. Okay, let's see what the Arch File does. I'm kind of scared of double Arch File. I hope they don't do that. <laughs> Archifile's proportions are so funny with how long their arms are, but it really does look like a really faithful adaptation of its depiction in the original Dooms. It's, it literally just looks like a 3D version. Boosts available. What does that mean? The Doom Twitter account tweet the Slayer with the sword. Yeah, yeah, they were congratulating Final Fantasy VII on releasing. <laughs> And it's just, they recreated the box art of Final Fantasy VII. I had to do a double take real fast. Because at, at first glance, I was just like, why are they posting a Doom picture if they're talking about Final Fantasy VII? And then, like, I had to open up the picture to see the full thing. And I was like, oh, I, okay, I see what you were doing. But I wonder... So, they must have had the they must have had the artist that does all the other art for the game draw that real fast, right? Like, I'm wondering if they just told him, hey, d draw us... Like, recreate the Final Fantasy VII logo with Doom Eternal stuff. What? Okay. I don't know, like, would they have paid him for that? But, maybe they just had someone, like, maybe they had a different artist do it? It's not just, like, a quick Photoshop job. It's, like, a new artwork. Hopefully they did. <laughs> just, I just imagine that was, like, a really weird thing. It's, like, why, <laughs> like, why are you making me work if we're advertising, you know, for Square Enix? Not even... Not even our own company. What are these guys doing? So slippery! Why are they running constantly? Back here. Okay, I shot him point blank. Nothing happened. There. They can teleport. Got him. Their strat is literally spawn as much road blockage as possible and just run away constantly. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> the way they're running. <laughs> the run animation is so funny because you never see an arch file run. They're usually just, they stay still and then they teleport. Where did they even go? Or it's people who played on easy mode. I don't know what the arch file does though, because the thing is every demon, every demon in this can summon uh, AI demons. So I don't know what makes the arch file unique if, you know, anyone can summon demons. So I'm wondering if their specialty is just summoning more, in which case maybe they really are supposed to just run around since they can't really fight you head on. He's running the whole time, shooting him in the back. Okay, so everyone's going to have half health. What is pushing me around so much? Wonder where he is. It's not like he's just running away the whole time. There he is. I'm stuck! 
They can make walls. Okay. <laughs> I was like, why can't I go through the fire? They're both very low. Oh my gosh. They teleported! <laughs> Get back here! Go through a debuff zone. <laughs> I'm not faster than him. He just stopped walking, okay. <laughs> he was like, I'm safe here. <laughs> no, you're not. Where's the other guy? I need to hit him before the other one respawns. Just once! I just need to hit him once! Gotta <sighs> leave him low. Do some balancing. No, it, I'll win pretty easily. They're just... They're just being annoying. Did I even hit him? They teleport <laughs> as soon as I hook onto them. There. Now I just need to find the other guy wherever he's hiding. The one that's really low. <laughs> no! <laughs> that's all they're doing. <laughs> Shoot a grenade up there. he had one health okay one down I finally got them. <laughs> I'm not rematching these guys. <laughs> Master Carver. No, I should have up to I should have upgraded dashing against these guys. Okay, if I win this next round, I will have three and owed them. It's best it's best of five, so first to three effectively. I just need to win one more. <laughs> That one guy was running around with 1 HP for so long. Round three. Maybe that's just what arch vials do. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> Did you see how short that round was? It doesn't need to be balanced. They were just they were just being funny. <laughs> just <laughs> throwing things throwing spawns behind them, throwing hazards behind them, throwing up a wall behind them. <laughs> I'm leaving that lobby. Ever played Etrian Odyssey? Isn't that a dungeon crawler pretty similar to uh, SMT? I almost got the one on 3DS. I was thinking about it when it came out. Yeah. What about it, though? <clears throat> I 
I'm just curious. Not sure about SMT. It looked a lot like the... It looked a lot like how... You know how uh, Strange Journey plays? How it's a, a first-person dungeon crawler? First-person dungeon crawler, yeah. Like a, like a grid-based first-person dungeon crawler. They're on sale for $10 on 3DS. Thinking of buying one. It's pretty cheapo. It, it probably has a lot of content, too. Just like, you know, SMT. Revenant, Pain Elemental. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm, these are both airborne. I bet the 3DS is actually a really just great system right now. Because imagine, like, obviously the 3DS has such a great library. And I bet all of them are super cheap right now. All the SMT games are also on sale. Oh, really? Even 4? I might want to get 4. I didn't play 4. I wanted to pick it up, but then I, I forgot why I had to pass. I think I was, like, busy playing something else or whatever. Okay, these guys are positioning a lot better than the other guys. the Revenant. Here he is. Ah! Can't escape me now. <laughs> Imagine the fear that goes through them when they get hooked with the with the uh, super shotgun. <laughs> they just have to break line of sight. Like, they have to put some sort of object in between us to make us, uh, to make the chain break. SMT's 4 is also $10. Ooh. I wish there was a way to, like, transfer your 3DS, transfer your digital 3DS games to your Switch. Oh, cried. As soon as I was chainsawing someone. They put a lot of enemies down. Do you live? Oh, he loot blocked me in time, didn't he? Okay, they're both low.
Thought he was safe there. It was the Revenant. Dang it. How did he get down there so fast? Okay, where's the Kaka Demon? He's just hiding on the other side of that building. He's just hiding on the other side of the building. good so that final boss fight pretty cool yeah it's pretty cool i'm glad they brought the boss fight back <clears throat> it's more of like a it's more of like a final boss sequence than a one-on-one -on -one fight like in doom 2016 but i still like it a lot try to get close enough to hook onto him it was very close Okay, where's the Kaka Demon? It'll be harder for him to hide. Okay, where is he? Where's he hiding? Oh, he's on the other side of that pyramid. Not lame like the Remember Me final boss fight. You beat it? Didn't take very long. What just bounced me up? Oh, I grabbed onto a boost pad. I actually want to keep him low. That's good. There you are. How the heck am I supposed to... Tr How am I supposed to run this guy down? hook up. I had to go fly up there. He was just barely in range. The final boss fight was easier than some of the regular fights. What? How would they do that? Boss fight's supposed to be the ultimate test of skill after playing the whole game. Round three. It's kind of a mad game, yeah. Yeah, you told me. 6.5 out of 10. You cannot escape me. <laughs> it's so funny going in the air with them. He's very low. I'd rather focus on this guy now. Okay. Easy peaser. Just need one hit on the Revenant. Probably on the other side of this pyramid, like normal. There he is. <laughs> they always go to that pyramid to hide around it. Three and Ode, once again. So it's annoying that you can't skip cutscenes. And remember me? I don't understand why unskippable cutscenes exist. Like, do you just 
want to ruin the replay value of your game on purpose, there's no reason for it. <clears throat> I want to play as the demons to try it out, but the fact that... The, the fact that the demand for a Slayer is so much higher makes me think that there aren't many good Slayers going around. And so if I'm doing really well as a Slayer, I kind of want to keep taking advantage of that. <laughs> if you stay in the same lobby, it shuffles you around. So now I'm a Revenant. But most of the time when someone gets put onto Slayer, they just quit the lobby and then I have to find a new one again anyway well, look yeah see it's like after each after each match it shuffles around the positions and people don't want to play as the slayer so they leave so then i have to queue up again and i get put as the slayer because no one wants to play slayer <laughs> it was also annoying in platforming sections that instead of respawning you with less hp they just counted as a death in reload cutscenes Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. It's on PS3, right? That's Is that what you were playing it on? By the way, speaking of PS3 games, I ordered a component to HDMI adapter. See, what happened was I was right about to order one, but then like that, like right when I was about to order, it's when people started reporting their Amazon orders not getting shipped and stuff. Uh, and then I wanted to wait just in case that got worse. But it seems like, you know, it, I mean, people are still getting their orders, even if it takes a bit longer. But anyways, I ordered one, which means I will be able to stream PS3 games. First PS3 game I want to stream, Osura's Wrath. And then uh, God Hand 2. I might want to actually beat God Hand first. <gasps> What's this? I didn't get match made as a... I didn't get put as a Slayer this time. It's also on 360 and Steam, though. I didn't know it was on Steam. Why do I have a diamond, like, why do I have, like, a diamond border around my name? I don't, but, like, I didn't have that a moment ago. I, I don't have that much XP, if that's what it's basing it on. But yeah, uh, once that converter comes in, if it all works well, if it all goes well, I'll be able to stream PS3 games. And I really want to stream Oscar as Wrath because the game is basically an anime. They even format it like episode one and like halfway through the episode, there's a bump, like there's a commercial in between. And then at the end of each episode, there's credits. <laughs> so it's like, it's like we'll be watching an anime together. <laughs> See the border around my name? It's like all... Shiny and iridescent. Okay, I'm a revenant. Doot doot. Uh, let me remember these controls. Okay, that's the lock on. L2. Okay, L2 is hover. And then, uh, what the? Haste, carcass. Carcasses might be annoying. Probably shouldn't be getting so close to him, actually. Noxious hazard. I can't I put the hazard down. Oh, it's still on cooldown. Look how bad these slayers are.
We rubber banding. I think that was a bit of rubber banding, yeah. Look how bad these slayers are. No wonder people don't want to be slayer. Like, if they just see that all the time, they'll think that the demon side's stronger. Thieving hand. Yeah, that's really good. Makes it where your summon minions, when they hurt the slayer, it gives you a percentage of that health. Like, like the minions hurt the slayer, and then you get 50% of that health from... Like, you get 50% of that damage in health back. Hmm. It's boxed in. <laughs> Where's the cooldown for my uh, jetpack? Oh dang, all my stuff's on cooldown. Oh, this rubber banding. That's my hue to get out of there. I forgot about loot block. Did that even hit him? We got him. <laughs> that was a good position for me. Did you see that? Like, I was level with the platform he was on, so I was able to spawn my... My minions really easily, and then just boom, boom, mow him down. Bigger bar, bigger HP. No, buff minions. He's not really going after me very aggressively. It's because I played the hard mode, I know. <sighs> I was forged in the fires of nightmare mode. Turned me into an unstoppable machine of efficiency. Where is he? Whoops, I meant to do this. Saw some loot, didn't want him to get it. Oh, whoa, whoa, where is he? How do you get behind us so fast? He got behind us so quickly. Get me out of here. Get me out! Is that a healing zone? Oh, yeah, it is. Forgot we had those. <laughs> we just, we just kick back here. The minions do all the work. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> we just put everything right there. <laughs> Did you notice my trumpet costume for the Revenant? That was a pre-order bonus. <laughs> it's so f it's so fun not being the Slayer because you just sit back, throw out all this junk, and it takes care of it for you. If they're not a good Slayer. <laughs> Damage done, 420. I actually had calculated that in my head to do precisely no more than 420 damage and no less. Okay, we're probably going to get made to be a slayer again. 
Who should I do? Uh, should I? Well, okay. Hold on. You have to, uh... Like, should I do Revenant again? So there's Revenant, Pain Elemental, Marauder, Mancubus, and Archvile. I feel like Revenant's the most fun because you can fly around. You know? Pain Elementals can fly too, but they're slower and they can make shields. Marauder seems like it could be fun. Hey, look. Not a Slayer again. Oh, you can change it here. I thought you had to pick it beforehand. Yeah, uh, let's do Revenant again. I like Revenant. Even though, like, if I get against... If I go against a Slayer that's really good, he's going to be hitting me a lot. We probably want something tankier. I'm too scared to pick Mancubus because if a Slayer just rushes down a Mancubus and just weapon swaps really fast and just, like, like you can just you can run circles around a Mancubus and weapon swap to just melt him instantly. So you kind of want to keep them far away from you if you're a Mancubus. I'd be too scared to do that. <laughs> you know, like I want to be able to be. I don't want to just be screwed if he gets close to me. Revenant can at least fly away real fast. Mankybiz is kind of stuck in one spot. I mean, he can still cast haste, but uh, Slayer's going to... It's not going to be faster than the Slayer for long. I'm trying to figure out why I have that border around my name, because I didn't have it around my name when I was the Slayer. I just did loot block. Why did he do it? I guess he was like in the mo in the process of pressing the button like as soon as I pressed it. That's why voice chat would be good so you can coordinate better. Oh crud. I actually just need to run because if he kills me right now, uh, we're going to lose. But I need to not like be too high because then he can hit me easily with the... Uh oh crud, he was right I was right behind him. Keep him busy. When's my loot block ready? One second. Okay. Whew. Doesn't he have the doesn't he have the health? Evil robot fifty-four. Doesn't he have the health area? Is he not going to is he not going to cast it for us? I don't know if he has it or not. I just assuming he does. But it depends which loadout he picked. Get away! I had to cast haste real fast to get away. My teammates not well. Never mind. I'm not going to be someone that blames their teammates. Oh look, he might see. Look, he might win right here. Playing a dirty arch file. What? Eating hands pretty good. Plus, I need some sustain. Need some self reliance here. Evil robot wasn't evil nor robotic enough.
Yeah, I need, I need to probably just harass someone. Yeah, I know, like, everyone's streaming the Final Fantasy VII Remake right now. But, uh... Like, obviously there are people playing the multiplayer in this because the queue times aren't long at all. He's just... <clears throat> my teammate's kind of just rushing down the Doomslayer, and the thing is, 1v1, the Doomslayer will win every time. Which is why you need to sort of whittle him down and harass him from afar. Anyway... I was about to shoot the demon just out of a reflex, but I was like, no, wait, he's my ally. <laughs> hey, where, where's, where's Slayer? Slayer. Almost got him. Got him. I'm going to take the majority of the credit on that. <laughs> How's how was a 60-40? Buff minions, yeah. <laughs> Hit my my uh, my ally did help get him that low though. It's not a competition. We're on the same side. <laughs> Yeah, FF7 Remake's taking over Twitch right now. It's such a big deal. Protect me, minion! Ace lasts a while. Ace is pretty good. Well, that has a long cooldown, though, too. Yeah, okay. We just have to harass him from far enough away. I think my teammate caught on to it. Especially his Archvile. Archvile, all of his abilities seem like they're made to just kind of, like, stay away. Oh, he went into the portal. I almost killed him with that uh, debuff zone. Did you see that? That, that uh, noxious zone? Where is he? Slayer health critical. Loot block him then. Where is he? I hit him. We almost got him. We got him. <laughs> okay. Yeah, my teammate was being pretty helpful that time. So I would say we I would say we were both pulling our weight. <laughs> it's it's more like you're supposed to just kind of whittle him down, team heal. If I do that, how am I supposed to activate it? R3? Okay, R3 is the heal. Does half of my health and a quarter of my allies' health. Did the heal. Oh, dang. 
I couldn't tell what weapon he had on. Was that the, uh... I exploded like it was the rocket launcher, but I didn't see any. Wow, look at the, the archvile claws from first person perspective. Looks so cool. Hey, look, he, I think he might be able to wrap it up himself. I would still try to play it safe, though. Oh, yeah. Doom, Doom guy wasn't really pushing his advantage there to stop me from, re from respawning. Block this shield. We got him. Oh, look at that. We did the pincer attack on him. We got him trapped. He was heading toward... I knew he'd be heading towards that portal. Or at least that would be his safest route. So I went ahead and blocked it. In case he went over there. Hope your copy comes earlier than what it currently says. <laughs> when does it say? I heard it was selling out in some places, but I didn't hear about that happening anywhere around where I am. I doubt it would sell out where I am. Aw, they left. Tuesday. <clears throat> it's not that long. Just this weekend. Like, you have to wait this weekend. Sold out on Amazon already. Oh, really? Wow. I feel like the reception of the game could have easily gone bad. I feel like the reception of the game could have easily gone badly if a few of the a, a few of the uh like Maximilian dude for example, like he was pulling so many viewers for that game and there are a few other ones too that just like you know there there are a few content creators Oh dang, look, this guy has the flaming skin. There are a few content creators who are longtime fans of FF7 who responded very well to the remake and like everything it's doing. And I feel like that really just got people excited for it because it was pretty much just unanimous, unanimously positive things to say about it, right? And like now it's huge on Twitch. I wonder how it would have been if like a lot of people were to be sort of mixed about it like I am by saying like, oh, they shouldn't have taken, you know, like Square Enix shouldn't be trading turn-based as an outdated thing and, oh, they shouldn't have made it just episode one. They should have, you know, made it the whole thing. Or at least they should advertise that it's episode one on the box because it does not say anywhere on the box that it's episode one on the front I'm talking about. It says it like on the back somewhere, I think. But like, it's sort of misleading. It's sort of misleading advertisement because someone that's not in the know would think, oh, wow, they remade the whole game. You know, and then... Anyways, my point is, my point is, it seems a lot of people were willing to overlook all that, and as such, the response just seems to be amazing for it. You still wish we'd gotten the entire game? Yeah. So I'm just wondering if, like, some of the really big content creators, if they sort of critiqued it like I've been, I wonder how much better, uh... I wonder how much it would have affected the sales. You know what I mean? Probably not that much, though. What am I doing? I'm just, I'm just wondering how much influence other people have over someone's impressions about something. Because, like, people are getting so hyped about it. You know what I mean? It, it's really easy to get hyped about something if you're in a big chat room with people and they're all getting hyped. You know what I mean? Sort of like, a, sort of like mob mentality, but, like, the positive version of it. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. You know, like, getting excited with, about things with other people. Meant to do that. You, yeah. There's so much rubber banding going on. Where do you even where'd the where'd the slayer even go? Over there? I wish there were like vantage points I could land on. Oh, it's two revenants, too.
He just walked in front of me and... Why would he do loot block after I just did it? We're wasting it. I did, I did loot block, and then like three seconds later, he did loot block. Protect me. Connection, the connection here looks really bad. Like, we're kind of popping all over the place. Hope this doesn't make it seem to other developers that they can do this to milk remakes. Yeah. Because it sort of does... It's already, a, it's already a fact that you can milk nostalgia to an extent, right? That's just a fact that all companies know. Uh, the extent to which they get insidious with it varies, obviously. And the fact that the FF7 remake is being met with such positive feedback like just 100 percent positive feedback like it's sort of sending the message that that's going to become a trend maybe or at least you know setting a precedent that that works but on the other hand the resident evil 3 remake sort of got mixed response you know ff7 remake sort of got a very mixed response Dude, I'm pressing L1. So at least it shows that people will still be critical of something. But I just feel like... Like, imagine if it was inversed. Imagine if a lot of... Uh, imagine if a bunch of the reviews... Imagine if all the reviewers for the Resident Evil 3 remake and all the big content creators that played it were like, Whoa, this is so cool. Everything about it's amazing. It looks amazing. Nemesis looks great. You know, like, let's just say they just talked about the positive stuff. And they didn't really talk about the negative stuff at all. And then they started pointing out the negative stuff for the FF7 remake. Like, just imagine if the roles were reversed in terms of reviewer reception and content creator reception. I wonder if, uh, you know, everyone else would have sort of changed their, like, flipped their opinions like that, too. Of course, there's no way to actually test it. Sort of, it's sort of the, uh, the... The drawback when you want to, you know, test things like that is that you can't actually legitimately test it. You can just kind of use it as like a case. You can kind of cross-examine it with a case study of something else. Spawn enemies behind him. Surprise! Where'd he go? We almost got him. Oh, my uh, my my debuff zone almost finished him off. Loot block him. Loot block him. He's critical health. He's about to pick up all that health. We got him. Nice. Round one. That we got thieving hand already. Buff minions. Hmm. I don't know. I, I feel like thieving hand and buff minions are the best thing. To, everything seems good. What does that sound? Um. Am I going to have to listen to this the whole? Okay, I'm good. <laughs> if I had to listen to that the whole match, uh, the whole round, I mean, that would have been annoying. You kind of want to preemptively look at where the Slayer is heading and sort of cut him off. I was like in the middle of pressing at the same time he did. Dang it. We wasted a loot block. What? I thought I thought I uh, I evaded those missiles. I did a dash. Have 
How do I know if the minion that's currently out is dead or not? It's green if they're alive, right? And if it's all blue if, uh... Yeah, okay. I think that's how it works. Where should I put this? I can't tell. Like, how do I know if they have... How do I know if they're still up or not? I'm probably dead here. Yeah. I wish there was a faster way to switch between your different summons, because you have to use the D-pad. You can hold R1 to do it, but that's a little bit slower, And then, or alternatively, you can use the D-pad in which you have to do the claw. Is it 2 to 1? Okay, we're still winning. Wait, no. No, crud. 1 to 2. He has 2. Team heal. Team heal's pretty good. I wonder if the buff minions I wonder if buff minions and thieving hand stacks with the baron that's good synergy if it does I don't know why he's trying to be so close to him so I get there. I think that was a direct hit. I not really do much when he's rushing me down. Hey, Baron's up. My eye needs to harass him a bit more. See, look, the ally's trying to duel him. I just have to run. Yeah, my ally, my ally just keeps trying to duel him there. We need to just stay back and harass him. Protect. Protect. Wait, did it? My ally kill him as soon as he respawned, or did the Slayer just kill himself from like, ha like environmental hazards? <laughs> Because he, like, died at the same exact time the other guy respawned, and I doubt we just immediately sniped him. Look how low he is already. What even happened? What, what's he doing? So he must be over there, right? What the heck happened over here? But my L1 isn't ready immediately. <laughs> we just have this giant army. Oh, he got, he got the BFG. <gasps> Crud! Man, I feel like I only want to play the demon side if I'm on voice chat with them, right? So I can tell my ally that maybe dueling the Doom Slayer isn't a great idea. <laughs> Yeah, remember, if anyone has this game and they want to play with me, just let me know, and we can add each other. I wonder how this game sold compared to FF7 Remake, because the thing is, you can't really look at Twitch as a reflection of sales all the time, because games that do well on Twitch aren't necessarily 
the best selling games, you know, and and likewise, the best selling games might not be the games that do well on Twitch. Like, I'd imagine that Doom Eternal has more mass appeal than Final Fantasy VII, just because if if like any JRPG, any JRPG automatically has that sort of weird stigma to it that a lot of like uh, broski gamers don't play. You know what I mean? Whereas Doom, even if you haven't played a Doom game before, it's like, oh, it's an FPS, like COD. Is it crossplay? I don't think it is. I don't think Doom Eternal is. FF7 has more viewers than League of Legends. Are you serious? I want to look at that. I have to see that to believe it. I think I should try a different demon. Uh, who should I do next? I want to try Marauder. Arcus, Arachnit Ooh, Arachnitron. The drones are really annoying, though. Even though they give them drops, like, lots of times it's not even worth... Hmm. I think I'll try... I think I'll try the that one. Uh, dang. Uh, Valorant, whatever the heck Valorant is, it's the most popular game on Twitch, even though I've never even seen it. have no idea what Valorant is. And then Final Fantasy VII is this... What the? What kind of weird timeline are we in? Some game I've never heard of is number one. FF7 remakes number two. Where's Doom Eternal? Doom Eternal's probably like a couple thousand, maybe two or three thousand now, right? That's where, I'd admit, that's where I'd predict it would be. League's new shooter has the most viewers. Is Valorant League shooter? It's a, that's a league. That's a Riot game. It's the League Overwatch ripoff. Oh, okay. Wait, so is it like League or is it like Overwatch? Is it like is it like first person perspe perspective laning? Where is Doom Eternal? I can't find it. Here it is. Oh, only two point two k. I predicted between 2 and 3k. It's so weird to think, though, that, like, Doom Eternal is one of the biggest releases of this year, don't you think? Doom Eternal is one of the biggest releases of this year, and it has multiplayer. So, you'd figure it would have a lot of staying power, but it could just be that FF7 remake launched, you know, which, like, right after it, which is sort of skewing everything. That's a cool podium, look at that. Hang on, he has the, he has the, uh... He has the Ghost Rider skin on, but it's green instead of black. What the heck? I think this guy is I think this guy is a good slayer, probably. Merciless Exterminator. Link Lethal. I literally have never even seen what Valorant is, and it somehow has the most viewers. How is that even possible? Is some big streamer just playing it and that got it popular or something? Let's see here. Uh Summit 1G is playing it. That's prob that probably helps it a lot. It'll die out like Overwatch. Overwatch... I wouldn't say Overwatch died out. It just sort of leveled out. You know what I mean? It's still relevant. And no matter how much League levels out, no matter how... No matter how unpopular League gets, it will always be relevant. It's a closed beta. So much for it being a closed beta when it's the biggest game on Twitch. We started like on Tuesday. Maybe there aren't many people playing it, but there are a lot of people wanting to watch it because they can't play it. Overwatch keeps dropping in viewers. Yeah, I mean, I guess level that implies that it got stable. I mean, it can get less popular and still be relevant, is what I mean. Oh, look at this. I have a shotgun in one hand and an axe in the other hand. Okay, so how does this work? This is the healing zone. Okay, I have a healing zone. Oh, crud. Healing zone. Get in the health zone, dude. Oh, is that defense buff? It is. I'll try to cast it on him next time. What the heck? Oh, yeah, I forgot. I can dash. You can dash as... You can dash as the Marauder. The connection here feels awful. 
I don't know if people playing this game just have bad internet. Like, if it's just the typical, like, COD player playing on Wi-Fi, or if the game's netcode is bad. But, uh... A lot of these matches, it feels like the connection's awful. It's the Wi-Fi Warriors, probably. Because it's very inconsistent. It's like, suddenly, it just feels like things are rubber banding around. Because I'd imagine that... I'd imagine that... Uh, people playing fighting games are much more specific about Ethernet than, you know, some someone that's just playing Doom, and then they want to try out the multiplayer. See, I the Marauder's like the only demon that can actually sort of go toe to toe with the Doom Slayer. Everyone else just needs to stay back. Are you kidding me? Yeah, see, the Mankybus, Mankybus is trying to duel him. Mankybus needs to stay far away. Like, he's made for, like, long-range artillery. Dang it. I'm going to run away from the Mankybus this time. Try to split the Doomslayer's aggro. Mm -hmm. that, looks, that looks good. That looks better for dueling. I'm... They tease you by starting the beginning part of the Doom Hunter song and then it stops. Dude, uh. I tried to heal him. See how fast the Mancubus is dying? He's not moving or anything. Okay, he came back. Nice. I saw long enough. Where was he? Where was the Doomslayer? He was hitting me with the Arbalest. Was he above me? He's just, even like when I try to split his aggro, when I try to harass him from the other side, he's just running down the Mancubus first. People are constantly leaving the lobby. Sort of weird how, from the Marauder's perspective, you're holding the shotgun in your left hand constantly. But, from the Doomslayer's perspective, he only grabs the shotgun when he's actually using it. I keep, and I keep... Thinking that double bearded axe is the same size on both ends, but it's not. It's sort of like an optical illusion. It makes it look like it's turned, but it's not. Okay, I'm the slayer again. So now my name is around now my name is surrounded in gold. It's like some sort of dynamic like rank. Have I done this arena before? I think so. Is this the first arena I ever did? Oh, forgot to ready up. There's this arena, the icy one, the fiery one, and super gore nest, and was there a fourth one? I feel like four would be a good number.
They need to get back into Slayer mode. The, uh, Pain Elemental is staying in here. Um, what's he doing? <laughs> Is he just watching? He's running! I did not get him. They pushed me into the portal. Is that what you wanted? Pfft. The ammo. do that you can show off a lot more with the slayer Round two. with the demons it's more just having like consistent consistent strategy and like trying to block him off and sort of you know staying a good distance away Where is he? Thought I, I just thought I was more hurt than that. I didn't get him. How much do I have to shoot him? Jeez. Let's get the uh, pain elemental a bit lower. Where is he? Pain Elemental is staying inside, which is actually kind of smart. Oh, they're rubber banding. Oh boy. That would have been really good if they loot blocked me there. But they didn't. <laughs> Got too close to the ground. Master Carve. Kidding me? Putting their putting their uh, health zone and their and their uh, debuff zone right by each other. Oh, what is pushing me?
Hey, Elemental's inside. The, uh, the pain elemental is positioning a lot better. It's already kind of low, though. Where'd he go? I need to get it much lower. It's a lot easier to nuke the Marauder. Okay. I was trying to get up those stairs. There were so many minions in the way. I can't believe I lost that. Uh... I need to focus the Marauder really fast to get him out of the way. And then when he's gone, I can hurt the Pain Elemental quite a bit. And then when the Marauder respawns, that's when I should finish off the Pain Elemental and kill the Marauder a second time. Getting off for tonight. See you next time. Okay, hi. I will see you later then. And I hope you get your uh, FF7 copy <laughs> mailed in time. So yeah, I hope you have a good night. It was hurting me like a lot there, but I didn't actually lose much. It just felt like I did. Did that not hit him? Pain Elemental can dash. Why did it make me switch to a machine gun? <gasps> machine gun. Oh, they have a Baron. I had literally one HP, and I was loot blocked, wasn't I? It's actually kind of close. You can't get armor from them, that sucks. I wonder if it was a player or a minion that shot me there. They got me caught out really early. Wait a minute, did they even let me... Yeah, we already have three. I already have three things, so I can't pick one. This is the tiebreaker. I didn't want the uh, rocket launcher on there. What just pushed me from behind? Need resources. Something hit me really hard when I was flying. Dude. 
couldn't hook on to him, even though the uh, marker was on there. They don't want to hit that. There's a lot of stuff out. Okay. Pain elemental is low. Oh boy. Not the Baron. That timing. Then spawning more Ragnatrons there saved me. What's he doing? What the heck? Waiting for server and then I die? You just standing there, I lock on. It says waiting for server, then I die. That's probably the most feels bad man way you could lose. Let me find another lobby again. When when I find a lobby with a good connection, I wish they wouldn't leave when the team gets shuffled. My eyes are kind of... Eyes feel like I need to just keep them closed for a bit. <laughs> I think I was focusing so hard on that that my, I was keeping my eyes open longer. Slayer again. Mankybits is higher leveled. I should probably uh, whittle him down. I got some of this XP from the single player, though. Which means if I got like around 14 XP from beating the single player, then the Marauder probably hasn't even beaten single player. Which means I could probably prey on him more, but like I'd want to whittle down the higher level guy just to keep him like close to death. Since it's a lot easier for me to bring the other guy from 100 to 0, at least in theory. Is it a Marauder and a Pain Elemental? Yeah. <laughs> Pain Elementals are animated so well. Okay, I have not done this arena yet. Wait, is this the Gornest? No, this is not. Yeah, I haven't done this one yet. Okay, so I want to keep him in critical and then just burst down the other guy as soon as I find him. There he is. I don't think he sees me.
Okay, so they're both low. What is shaking my screen so much? What the heck was that? He's literally just hiding behind this. <laughs> Did you see him trying to hide behind that pillar? <laughs> uh, so yeah, my theory is uh, consistent so far. Has been disproven. Uh, let's get that. <clears throat> the Marauder's a lot easier to... to uh, to uh, harass. So I'd rather focus on getting the more experienced guy down into critical, which will kind of keep, make him stay hesitant. Then he's hiding underneath. Dang, he did not last long. Okay, where's where's the Marauder? There he is. I'm trying to get up on this ledge, jeez. We got him. Nice. Yeah. Pain elemental respawn with half health doesn't really have that much either. Let's get. Uh, I don't know if we need that. Let's. I think getting the faster dash regen is good when they have a marauder or an arch file because the marauders and arch files are pretty fast and they try to run away a lot. So that helps you chase them down. you they were a little late on that so hard to chase him. How is he still up? Okay, where is he? Where is he? I wonder what happens. I wonder how they do a tiebreaker if you get a timeout.
Did I even hit? Got him. <laughs> it's a lot harder for the pain elementals to hide. It's a Marauder skin we're about to unlock. Huh? Really? You know, you'd figure this game would have more people in the multiplayer. I guess it's pretty similar to how the Doom 2016 multiplayer was, though. Most people just get the game for the single player. They they play the single player and then they're done. I should see. If my uh, friends from Doom 2016 are playing it, but I don't remember their names. A lot of these people changed their names too. I really don't recognize some of these people. They changed their names. Nine hours ago? Who did normally plays on PC? I guess maybe he was just playing something not streaming. What? Is no one on? I'm not the Slayer. Thank you, Biss. Mm.
Говоря. Nice. That was actually some really good teamwork. We were doing the loot blocks at good times. Thieving hand. I like the I like the image for it. Very telling of what it does. You have to really lead your shots as the Revenant. Are those our hazards or are they just on the map? I didn't see he was chainsawing. Nice. It's a creepy looking mancubus color. Buff minions. Mm. Tactical actions. That includes the the caustic zone, right? I feel like the caustic zone is a lot more reliable than the minions. Even though the buffed minions would synergize with thieving hand. I just want to try this out. Revenant had more fuel. Did I take self damage there? Oh, we both did it at the same time. Yeah, see, if you had voice chat, you could call out who's going to do the, uh, you could just, you could just say who's going to do the loot block. Whoever calls it will get to do it first. So that way the other person can save theirs. Wait, did he take... Can you do self-damage? Keep him off me. Nice. I was right about to use the caustic zone too. Victory. We three and Odom. Did we get a Marauder skin? change oh you have to go back here inferno lord red color scheme <laughs> the fire on the axe is so overkill <laughs> <laughs> 